This is Dave Rudin. I'm here up at the Aquitur for uh, State Football Media Day with New Canaan coach Lou Marinelli and Darian coach Rob Trafone. Uh, we couldn't get this uh, press gathering down in Fairfield County, unfortunately, as much as uh, two of these guys lobbied. But uh, seriously, why don't you two talk about, uh, both of you talk about the relationship you guys have. I think everybody thinks it's really adversarial just because of the rivalry between your teams, but that's not the case at all. No, it is. I hate it. <laughs> no, absolutely. We hate each other. We don't talk. At least one day a year. <laughs> so, well, this, and, but, and this time, two days a year. But tell them the truth. I hate them. So, <laughs> so we actually are good friends, and there is mutual respect. Lou won't admit it, but he likes me. So, and he's got to live with that fact. Uh, you know, it, 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 to to have two teams that are so uh, talented at, at coming from our league, I think says an awful lot. And I know how hard, uh, and and I, I really uh, respect and admire what he's done at their end. And uh, especially this year's team, uh, to watch those kids develop the way they have, it's just unbelievable. Uh, especially the the, uh, the quarterback. See how he's come so far, and watching him since he was a freshman, you know, in seven on sevens and things like that, he's done a great job. He really has. And you know, to have our league, we know one thing that regardless of what happens, an FCAC team's going to win one state championship for sure. Well, to have three in the finals yep. is quite an accomplishment yep. for the league. And the same goes true for for Lou and his program. When you think of honestly of high school football in the state of Connecticut, Lou Marinelli's name comes up right away, and, and always will. You know, he set the bar very high, not only in Fairfield County, but in the state of Connecticut. And when I moved from McMahon over to Darien, I mean, quite honestly, I looked at my staff and, and you know, players and said, that's the program that you want to emulate. That's, uh, look at what they're doing. You know, so uh, we're, we're very honored and proud to be here. You now I have to pay him a lot of money for what he just said. <laughs> You've both been here before. Obviously, the build-up to state final the week before is a big, big one. How is it different with you two playing each other? Is it just escalated that much more? Does it change anything you do? Well, we know each other so well. Yeah. Uh, to be honest with you, the preparation was a little easier than if it was a total unknown, but harder in the respect that you know it'll be a chess match, and, and they're a great staff and. We know whatever they tried to do, they're going to turn around and, and you know do something different. And so, uh, and obviously for the kids, it's a great build-up. Yeah, it's it's somewhat easier, and plus you had a chance to see, you know, the first time uh, what worked, what didn't work. So it's a little bit easier in that regard. And and you know when when we play uh, teams outside the league, him Middletown and us with uh, North Haven, uh, you don't know really what to expect pretty much know what to expect from the two of us. Uh, I mean, you know, so close and we play every year. Lou, I know obviously your kids, uh, your team wanted Darian to get to the final because you wanted a chance to avenge your one loss of the year. Rob, did you want New Canaan? Well, he wants to be his twice. I want to spend every day of the year with Lou, so, uh, <laughs> you know, just to give me one more opportunity to be by his side. Um, you know what? Uh, it's a hard call because I, I like Lou, I love playing teams like North Haven and Daniel Hand, who we never play, and Middletown, and I like the challenge of the unknown, uh, rather than bashing each other's heads in in the same league. So, honestly, given the opportunity to play another team, you know, would have been ideal, but I know the kids enjoy it, you know, from both communities, the kids enjoy the challenge. Yeah, our game, I think, uh, as I said in the uh, press conference, it's really it's two very proud communities with two very good programs and kids that work very hard at football. And it's really all that's good about high school football. So, um, <laughs> although I don't know that I'd rather have played Darianne, I mean, I, I feel the same way Rob does. Uh, sometimes it's nice to go out of the league and play uh, some team that, you know, from upstate. How would you describe the rivalry? What is, what is the rivalry? What about from your kids' standpoint? Well, I think there's two sides to the rivalry. What the community views, you know, the two communities, and, and what these coaching staffs and the kids view. Um, you know, the communities think that there's a lot of animosity 
And the reality is these kids are very competitive. And I know they'll go back and forth on Twitter or Facebook or whatever. But, you know, at the end of the day, a lot of them are actually friends. And there's certainly mutual respect. And the same is true for the two staffs. You know, we'll, we'll poke fun at each other and what have you. But at the end of the day, you know, there's tremendous mutual respect. And we work together in the offseason, you know, in the passing leagues and, and everything else. Yeah, I would say that... Uh you know, you have uh, you have two teams, a rivalry that is absolutely tremendous. One of the best rivalries I think in the state, but it brings out the best in our kids, and in, in, in not not just McCain kids, but in, in both our teams. I mean, uh, the way they played us the first game was tremendous. I mean, they they hung in there, they hung in there, and then uh, and, and they and they beat us uh, flat out. So I, I think the rivalry brings out the best in both teams and coaching staffs. Well, the best thing, and number one, everybody loves Darien, New Canaan, so Fairfield County, and I was very happy. And the best thing is uh, there will be at least one FCX state champion. So, Rob, Lou, thanks a lot, and we wish you the best of luck on Saturday. Thank you. Can I hit him Thank now? you, Dave.